Hello. Um, this is basically the poker trips trick. Um, I'm gonna be teaching you all my tricks. Um, they're not that hard, but some of them can be really challenging if you're up to the task. Um, this is called the poker trip shuffle. Um, this one is really cool. You can like do it really pro. You can like show off, show off for people. Um, basically, you do is start out with since you're a beginner, start out with two coins, two different colors. Um, all you do if you're left-handed, you can use your left hand if you're right-handed, whichever way is comfortable for you. Um, basically, all you do is basically shuffle them. You do is you take your pinky and put this on on one side. You just put on the other, so it looks like this. So basically, you're going like this. And then use your um, pinky and thumb to push in, and use your middle finger to pull it up. So it's basically like this, and just like use your thumb and pinky to push in, so it goes like that. So like the formation is like that, so it like slides in. Then you use all your fingers to push it back in, and then you split it in half. Um, it's not that hard. It's pretty simple. It's, yeah. And then if you get better, you can add more. Yeah, you can add so much more if you want, if you get really good at it. Um, yeah, that's basically the um that shuffle. Um, this is called what I call like the co front coin back. It's where you take the front coin, roll it back. Yeah, it's not that hard. You gotta get comfortable with it. So it's basically okay. First, you hold it by. You hold it in the middle, where as you like, as you can see, but you have to have your um for um middle finger at the bottom, and your index and fourth finger guiding on the side, and your pinky just does nothing. And use your thumb if you're right-handed. Use your thumb and push all the way forward, and you take the first one out. So try first doing this. If you first do this, it'll help you a lot because. That helps you lift it up and put it back down and like bring it back and put it inside the back. Basically all you do is just keep, you always have to keep this formation. My friends are always tempted to do that, like to drop all of them. Don't do that. Use your um, middle, fourth finger and index finger to like squeeze them so then like if you move anywhere it won't fall. So now use your thumb, pull up the first one in the front and then push it down. So it comes to the back, and you just pull it up, come to the back. Slow motion, it's like this. Yeah, and then fast motion is like that. So basically, all you have to do is, yeah, just do that. Um, now, this one, that was basically called the front-to-back coin trick, which I like to call that. Um, that's basically how you do it. Um, now, time for, um, like, the, the coin, the spinning trick, like that. I like call it, I like spinning tricks. So cool. It's like you can show off a lot of people. That one would do go well. Um, basically, I suppose you to do this, like kind of like this order: green, white, green. And so, <clears throat> all you have to do, wait, my hand is sweaty. All you have to do is hold it by the middle, like the equator, almost like the equator of the world. Um, and go like this. Use your middle finger to pull out the middle yeah and then basically try that first like pull it out with your middle finger because some people are tempt to like pull out two instead of one and all you have to do is pull out the middle with your middle finger you can't pull out that far so then use your pinky to pull it out so then it's like that so that was like a small hole and then it goes like that and then try putting it back in like that and so basically, it's like, it's like that. So it's not that hard, but once you get the hang of it, you'll get it, trust me. And now, when you spin it, you have to have your pinky and your and middle finger always stiff, and keep your thumb and middle finger stiff. And then use your fourth finger, don't do anything. Use your middle finger, spin it around, and then place it back in. So, this is in slow motion. Okay, that's how you do that spinning part, and then this is fast motion. Yeah, not that similar, but 
yeah, that's basically how you do that part. Um, this is also one that where you like you have to have a poker chip table where you bounce it off the ground like that, and it just hops back onto your poker chips. Like boom. Sometimes it goes too far, but yeah. And then there's also called the butterfly. I can't really do it, but you go like this and go like that, and then yeah. And then also the, there's a coin roll where you have it on your thumb bring it over onto your index finger, bring it over onto your middle finger, bring it over on your fourth finger, and onto your pinky. I can't really do it that well because I'm not that good, but um, that's basically how you do some of my coin tricks. Um, you can show off using this. I usually just walk around using this because i gotten better on this spinning trick. And you, you can probably do it with more, but... It's really hard. Yeah, I'm using that many. Um, that's basically all. Um, that's all. Thanks for watching.